Thanks for tuning in to the BSN Nuggets weekly breakdown presented by Frosted Leaf. Frosted Leaf, Denver's most innovative dispensary, has the hottest strains, no lines, no weight, and a self-paced direct shopping experience that allows a fast yet comfortable transaction without the awkwardness of a waiting room. I'm Allie Monroy, and alongside me is BSN Nuggets beat writer Harrison Wind. The Denver Nuggets continue to struggle, losing six of their last seven games. Harrison, what is something you believe needs to change in this Nuggets team so they can find some sort of rhythm again? Over this stretch, they've been playing really good teams. That's the thing. The Milwaukee's of the world, the Houston's of the world. They've been losing to good teams, and they've been playing really, I'd say, three and a half quarters of really good basketball. But late in games, late in fourth quarters, the Nuggets are struggling. If you look at the stats, the NBA keeps what they call clutch statistics when the margin is within five points with five minutes or less remaining. The Nuggets have committed a league-high 21 turnovers in those situations. And when you look at their best player, Nikola Jokic, he's turned the ball over too, but even more of a concern is he's taken only eight field goals in the last four fourth quarters. So that's just two shots in his last four fourth quarters per game. He's got to shoot the ball more late in games. He's Nuggets best player. He's their franchise player. So the Nuggets are struggling late in games. Jokic has to help these guys out and you know score the ball more late in fourth quarters. Well, the Nuggets will now try to avoid a sweep on the road as they travel to Minnesota to take on the Timberwolves on Wednesday. They then head home to host the Orlando Magic on Friday. What do you expect to see from these two matchups? Yeah, the first one in Minnesota, it's going to be an emotional game. We know that. Going back to Game 82 last year, Denver fell in Minnesota, of course, to keep them out of the playoffs. That was an emotional loss for a lot of guys. I remember being in that locker room. You could hear a pin drop. Nobody was really saying anything. So, you know, that's going to be on these guys' minds. And even though Minnesota gave up Jimmy Butler in that trade a couple weeks back, this is still a dangerous Timberwolves team. The guys they got back in that deal, Robert Covington, Dario Saric, are good players. And Minnesota's been playing pretty well since that trade, too. So it's going to be a tough game for sure, another tough Western Conference game. And then you look at the other one against the Magic. Nuggets have typically played better at home over the last couple years, and you definitely expect them to beat the Magic at Pepsi Center. But Orlando's no pushover. They're in playoff position right now in the Eastern Conference, and I know it's early, but Denver's definitely got to get up for that game. Well, finally, Will Barton remains out rehabbing from an injury. Could his absence be another big reason why the Nuggets are struggling to get wins? I think it is, and it's probably one that's getting pushed under the rug a little. He's still a week or two away from a reevaluation. We're not sure when he's going to get back, but he's a huge part of this team. And if you look at who is most important to a Nuggets win, it probably starts with Nikola Jokic at the top, Gary Harris right behind him. Will Barton might be that third guy. And if you're ranking Nuggets players in terms of how valuable they are to this team right now, he's great on offense. He can be a good defender when he wants to be. And so he's just another link in the chain that's missing right now. And, when he does get back, that's going to be a huge boost for this team. Well, be sure to catch all of our coverage on bsndenver.com. We also just released two new Nugget shirts, so be sure to check that out on bsndenverlocker.com. For Harrison Wind, I'm Allie Monroy, BSN Denver. Come check out Frosted Leaf's three Denver locations and download their app on both Apple or Android. You can also follow them on Snapchat or Instagram at Frosted Leaf Brand.